Have you ever felt uneasy when your car's engine idles erratically, causing a noticeable shaking or jerking sensation? This common issue becomes even more concerning when accompanied by a lit check engine light. At the heart of the problem lies an imbalance in the ideal air fuel mixture of 14.7.1, crucial for optimal engine performance. In this video, we'll explore the common causes behind these fluctuations, ranging from vacuum leaks and idle air control valve, IACV issues to sensor, malfunctions, ideal air fuel mixture, the foundation of engine efficiency, maintaining the ideal air to fuel ratio is critical for achieving optimal engine performance and efficiency. Your engine is designed to operate at a precise 14.7.1 ratio, ensuring that every drop of fuel is met with just enough oxygen for complete combustion. This perfect balance generates the right heat and pressure, driving the piston smoothly and consistently. When this ratio is disturbed, whether by vacuum leaks, clogged intake components, or sensor inaccuracies, the combustion process becomes erratic. Diagnostic tools, uncovering your engine's true health. Accurate diagnostics are essential for maintaining a healthy engine, especially when issues with the air to fuel mixture arise. Modern vehicles are equipped with an engine control unit, ECU, that constantly monitors sensor data, but identifying problems like vacuum leaks, faulty idle air control valves, or throttle body issues requires the use of diagnostic tools. An OBD2 scanner is invaluable in this process. It reads error codes stored in the ECU, offering insight into potential sensor failures or miscalculations affecting the ideal 14.7.1 air-to-fuel ratio. Reason 1. Vacuum leaks. One of the primary causes of unstable RPM fluctuations at idle is a vacuum leak. When extra unmeasured air enters the engine, it disrupts the ideal air-to-fuel ratio of 14.7.1, which is critical for efficient combustion. Without this precise balance, the engine control unit, ECU, cannot accurately calculate the amount of fuel needed, leading to erratic engine behavior, such as sudden surges or drops in RPM. Vacuum leaks typically occur due to cracked, loose, or worn vacuum hoses, faulty PCV valves, or leaks in the intake manifold, or throttle body gaskets. These leaks allow air to bypass the mass air flow, MAF sensor, meaning the ECU receives inaccurate data about the incoming air. As a result, the Aloifer engine may run too lean or too rich, causing inefficient combustion and noticeable performance issues while idling. To diagnose a vacuum leak, you can use simple methods such as spraying brake cleaner around suspected areas. A noticeable change in engine RPM indicates a leak. Addressing vacuum leaks promptly by replacing damaged hoses or faulty components can restore the proper air to fuel ratio, ensuring smoother idling and improving overall engine performance while potentially saving you from more costly repairs down the line. Reason 2. Idle air control valve issues. One common culprit behind erratic idle behavior is a malfunctioning idle air control valve, IACV. This valve is responsible for bypassing air around the closed throttle body. When your engine is idling, your vehicle is stopped, ensuring that the engine receives just the right amount of air for smooth operation. Over time, the IACV can become clogged with oil and carbon deposits, causing it to stick either open or closed. When the valve remains open, it allows excessive air to enter the engine, disrupting the delicate 14.7.1 air to fuel ratio necessary for efficient combustion. This imbalance forces the engine control unit, ECU, to miscalculate fuel delivery, resulting in unstable RPM fluctuations. A practical way to diagnose this issue at home is by disconnecting the IACV's harness connector. If the engine's idle, speed drops significantly after unplugging, it indicates that the valve is contributing to the problem. Conversely, if there's little to no change, the IACV is likely clogged and in need of cleaning or replacement. Addressing IACV issues promptly not only restores a stable idle, but also improves overall engine performance, saves fuel, and helps prevent further damage to your vehicle. Regular maintenance and cleaning of the IACV can keep your engine running smoothly and reliably. Reason 3. Throttle body problems. Throttle body issues are a common cause of erratic RPM fluctuations at idle. The throttle body houses a butterfly valve that controls the amount of air entering the engine based on how much you press the gas pedal. When the pedal is fully released, the valve should close almost completely to restrict airflow, 
ensuring that the engine receives just the right amount of air for an optimal 14.7.1 air-to-fuel mixture. However, over time, carbon deposits and grime can accumulate on the throttle body, causing the butterfly valve to stick or bind. This slight binding may keep the valve more open than intended, allowing excess air into the engine. The result is an imbalanced air-to-fuel ratio, leading to inconsistent combustion and unstable RPMs while idling. To remedy this issue, it's essential to clean the throttle body thoroughly. Removing the air intake duct provides access to the valve, and using tools like an old toothbrush, a sturdy paper towel, and a quality brake cleaner can effectively remove the buildup. For instance, a user with a 2018 GMC Sierra Denali experienced severe idle fluctuations until they cleaned the throttle body using AC Delco foam, which resolved the issue. Regular maintenance and cleaning of the throttle body can help ensure smoother engine performance and prevent future idle-related problems. Reason 4. Faulty Engine Sensors Engine sensor issues are a critical factor behind unstable RPM fluctuations at idle. Modern vehicles rely on multiple sensors, such as the mass airflow, MAF sensor, oxygen, O2 sensor, throttle position sensor, and engine coolant temperature, ECT sensor, to provide real-time data to the engine control unit, ECU. These sensors enable the ECU to accurately adjust fuel injection and spark timing for efficient combustion at the ideal 14.7.1 air-to-fuel ratio. However, when any of these sensors malfunction, they deliver incorrect readings. For instance, a faulty MAF sensor might underreport incoming air, causing the ECU to inject too little fuel, while a malfunctioning O2 sensor could lead to an overly lean or rich mixture. Similarly, if the throttle position sensor sends erroneous signals, the ECU may misinterpret the throttle status, and a failing ECT sensor can affect fuel calculations particularly when the engine is cold. To diagnose sensor issues, using an OBD2 scanner to retrieve trouble codes is essential. Once identified, cleaning the sensors with brake cleaner or replacing the defective ones can help restore proper engine performance. Addressing these sensor problems not only stabilizes idle RPM, but also improves fuel efficiency and overall driving reliability, ensuring your vehicle runs smoothly. Reason five, dirty engine air. Filter, a dirty engine air filter, is another common culprit behind unstable RPM fluctuations at idle. When your engine's air filter becomes clogged with dirt, dust, and other debris, it restricts the airflow into the IHI engine. This is especially problematic at idle, where the amount of air entering the engine is already minimal. The restricted airflow disrupts the ideal 14.7.1 air-to-fuel ratio, leading to inefficient combustion, and causing the engine RPM to fluctuate unpredictably. Over time, a clogged air filter not only affects idle stability, but also reduces overall engine performance, decreases fuel efficiency, and can eventually lead to more serious mechanical issues. Regularly checking and replacing your engine air filter is a simple yet effective maintenance task that can help maintain smooth engine operation. Reason six, battery or alternator issues. Battery or alternator issues can also lead to unstable RPM fluctuations at idle. The alternator is responsible for converting the engine's mechanical energy into electrical energy, charging the battery, and supplying power to the vehicle's electronic systems, including the ECU and various sensors. When the alternator malfunctions, perhaps due to a seized pulley or a faulty voltage regulator, it fails to generate sufficient voltage, especially at idle. This deficiency results in a weak battery, which in turn causes erratic sensor behavior and improper fuel injection, ultimately leading to fluctuating engine RPMs. For example, if the battery voltage drops below approximately 12.7 volts while the engine is running, the ECU may receive insufficient electrical power to process sensor data accurately. To diagnose this issue, one should start the engine and measure the battery voltage. A healthy system should register between 13.5 to 14.5 volts. Additionally, inspecting the wiring connections between the alternator's B terminal and the battery's WSD positive terminal is crucial, as any breaks or corrosion in these wires can disrupt the current flow. Ensuring that the alternator is functioning properly and that the battery is adequately charged is essential for maintaining stable idle speeds, 
and overall engine performance, ultimately saving time and money on potential repairs. Thank you for watching. If you found these troubleshooting tips helpful, remember to subscribe for more automotive repair guides. By understanding your engine's ideal air fuel mixture and using proper diagnostic tools, you're well on your way to a smoother ride and cost-effective maintenance. Drive safe and keep your engine healthy.